In this video, we'll be showing you how to run the ATV312 drive to run using the start stop and the dial of a VW3A1101 keypad. The first thing you want to go ahead and do is press the mode key and hold it for about three seconds. Once your LEDs are flashing one at a time, you want to press the escape key and hold it for about two seconds. And once the LEDs are flashing at the same time, now we can go ahead and press enter on the drive, scroll down to your control menu, enter, set the LAC parameter axis level to level 3, and make sure when you press enter on level 3, you have to hold for about 2 or 3 seconds, and it will blink once to confirm that setting. Escape back to LAC and scroll down to CHCF, enter. Set it to SEP, enter. Escape back to CHCF and scroll down to the CD1 parameter. And currently it's set to local since we forced it to local the first time around, but we want to make sure we set it to LCC, clockwise. Enter. At this point, you can escape back to your main menu, which is RDY. And just realize that the LEDs are flashing at the same time, which means right now you're in a programming mode. If you want to run the drive, you have to put it back into the run mode, and you can use the escape key and hold it down for about 2 or 3 seconds to go back and forth between local and programming mode. So right now they're flashing at, at one at a time. So now with our keypad, we can press run. And now we can use the dial of the keypad to speed up or slow down our drive.